Alrighty, hello guys, welcome me faces back to another video on my channel. Today we are going to be doing a time-lapse video of me building a tank for the map Ambush. Now the reason I'm going to do a time-lapse is because I'm really not feeling making a video today, um, and I don't feel well at all. But, I'm going to do a time-lapse to hopefully try and make it a video uh, for you guys. So, let's go ahead and get on with it, shall we? Alright, so we made it to this point right here, which I thought was a good point to, uh, to interdict, interdict, uh, what is the word? I don't know what the word is. Uh, but essentially we built it so that the tracks and the body of the, uh, the tank actually follow the same sort of pattern, if that makes sense. So if it goes in on the tracks, then it goes in on the, uh, the tank itself, which is good. So we're gonna go ahead and leave that a lot like this. This is, this is very nice. We're then going to go ahead and drag this guy, actually, we're going to leave it somewhat in the center, that's fine. And we're going to drag it forwards like that. So this is actually what it looks like right now. I think that's pretty good. What I'm going to do is actually change what the wheels and stuff look like, and then uh, we'll continue. Okay, so now seems like a good time to describe what we've done. So we've actually added some tracks on the front, obviously. We've added a hatch on the front as well. We added the driver's view. We also added some lights. We added some uh, little, like, vents, I guess. Uh, we added some views so we can see out sideways. We actually added some uh, vents on the back. We added a spare tr wheel on the back. We added the exhaust. We added the vents. We also added some uh, equipment right there and some boards, just in case we need those. Um, we added some lights. We also added... Uh, a way to get in and out on the back as well. We also obviously added a bunch of rivets as well because that's what I wanted it to look like. Anyway, if we went to drive it around now, I think it honestly looks pretty good. We now need an actual turret, so let's get on with that.
Okay, so there we go. I've added a bunch more stuff. I've actually added the turret. I've added a gun. The gun itself is a 57 millimeter gun and it has a propellant length of 500 millimeters, which is uh, pretty big, I would just say. So now what we need to do is actually fit everything in. So if we go to compartments, we need to actually make the basket space way bigger just so that we can actually fit the people in there. <laughs> there we go. Uh, then what we're going to do is go to ammo storage. We're going to grab a bunch of this. And we're going to go ahead and try and fit some of that in there as well. I want at least 12 rounds. Uh, if we can have more, we will have more. In fact, let's go ahead and try and put more in. Uh, and there we go. 21 rounds. That seems to make sense to me. And there we go. So that is it. That is all I want to do. Um, I do kind of want to do something down here as well. So I think the last thing we'll do is add some side panels and we'll go with that. Okay, so I'm not entirely sure I like the way this looks, but we're going to go ahead and go with it anyway. We're also going to go ahead and add one of these to the side, I guess. Yeah, we're going to go ahead and do that right there like this. And once we've done that, uh, in fact, actually, we'll add it on both sides. That's fine. We're going to go ahead and attach this onto there like this. We're then going to grab this piece and we're going to squidge it uh, because honestly, it doesn't look too bad when it's squidged. So we'll have it squidged. There we go. Okay, so now together we're going to go ahead and pick a livery. I think I want to go with the one I always go with uh, because I think it looks the best on this kind of tank. So there you go. That's all good. Condition, pretty good too. Grime, quite high. Metallic, a little bit. And there we go. Uh, decals? I don't know what this should be. I'm not actually going to put a decal on it. We're going to leave it as is. Uh, and hopefully that'll be okay. So let's go ahead and save this. I don't know whether... I'm not going to add any armor. We're not going to actually add any armor. It's going to be a 10 mil tank. So that's it. We're just going to go into battle. We're going to go into battle with no armor. Hopefully that's okay. So, oh, we're against these guys. These ones are the worst. Oh, no, they're not. They're not. The ones that are white are the worst ones. I can't actually seem to shoot. <laughs> I don't know why. Uh, that all goes to the cannon. That's fine. Uh, the crew are all in. Oh, we don't have a loader. The loader isn't actually loading a gun. There we go. All right, let's go. Right, there is actually a tank on this side now. Let's go ahead and shoot this guy. The white ones are the worst ones. So we'll shoot it. I think this might be it. No, it's not. It's not. Hopefully this goes through. Uh, some of it, maybe. I don't know whether our cannons are any good. We might have to make the cannon better. Somehow. Uh, this isn't working. We're not going through anything. Uh-oh. All right, so we're going to go to the gun. There we go. Firepower. Let's go ahead and see what it's got. So it goes through 77 mil, apparently. Uh, that is not actually true because it doesn't. But uh, let's go ahead and extend this. And it should go through more. There we go. Um, and if we want to, we can actually increase this to go with it. Uh, which might be strange. But yeah, 89. Okay. That might work. We'll see. All right, find the target. Shoot it. See if it goes through. Here we go. All right, that guy's dead. Okay, awesome. There's a guy up on the hill. Let's shoot him. Oh, can't see. And I'm getting bumped in the butt. The guy behind me is trying to mount me. Ah, this isn't how tanks are made. It's not. It's not. It's not. Okay, hang on. There we go. We got him as well. Nice. There are three enemies remaining. One just on the hill right there that nobody's shooting at. Oh, he's dead also. I haven't managed to kill anyone yet. My guys have killed all of them. That's a big yikes. Okay, let's go around this way. Yes. Oh, they've killed one of my guys. We're against the boss tank now. Oh, and I think it's that weird one. It is. It's the weird one. I'm scared of the weird one. I am actually scared of the weird one. Okay, it's changed targets. Let's try and track it now that we can. Can't seem to track it. Turn sideways for me, please. Oh, there we go. We tracked it. Nice. And now if we shoot it in the side... Might be able to kill it. Oh, change tanks. Hey, there we go. Someone else shot it inside. What are you guys doing? This is ridiculous. Okay, so there is one more thing that I actually need to do because I forgot to do it. We need to go to riveted uh, actual structural. There we go. Good. We're going to go ahead and shove a bunch of these on, uh, which are rivets, of course. And they're going to go on the gun themselves. There we go. 
Because I actually forgot all about adding them to the turret, so that is my job as of right now. We're going to add them to the turret. Okay, so just like this, that's fine. Don't know why those ones are like that, but there you go, good. And we're going to have to add the rest of them too. So I'm going to quickly do this, and then I'll be back with you guys. Alright, so there we go, we've added the rivets to the, uh, the turret, and now it looks a lot better than it did, so I'm happy with that. Yes! Alright, let's see if we can win this one. Alright, so these are the tanks that I couldn't get through before. Let's see if we can get through this one. I need to shoot it there. There we go, it's dead. Nice, let's continue. Yes, get in there! Charge the enemy! Alright, okay, here we go. So if we can, I need to shoot this guy on the right. Uh, if he ever shows, he isn't showing just yet, but let's wait for him. There he is. I killed him. I actually got him. I did just get shot myself, though, so... Uh, my driver is dead. <laughs> My driver's dead. All right, there are two enemies remaining. One of them's up there on the hill. I think my tanks will deal with him. And then the other one is presumably the boss tank at the end. Uh, but I don't see it, actually. Oh, there it is. It's finally coming. Okay, here we go. Maybe we can see it from here. Oh, it's one of those. It is one of those again. Let's try and track it. I need to track it. It's drove off. <laughs> I need to chase it now. Because it's driving away. Come back! I'm very much unsure as to what's going on here, because this tank seems to be reversing uh, all the way away from us. Uh, I have managed to track it on both sides, we're shooting underneath it. So now we are... it's just sliding down the hill. <laughs> it's just belly sliding down the hill. That is unfortunate, my guy. Good night. There we go. Alright, well anyway, I think I'm going to end this video here for now. Thank you guys very much for watching, hope you guys enjoyed it. And uh, if you guys like videos like this one where it was slightly edited in terms of um, like time lapsing and stuff like that, let me know in the comments down below and I'll see what I can do in the future. But for now, thanks for watching. See you next time. Goodbye.